In fact, so far, none of the airborne early warning aircraft we discussed can land or take off from a carrier. The situation is soon going to change, as we will see in a bit, but this role, now, it is covered by helicopters. As an interim solution, China initially purchased the Kamov 31 early warning helicopter from Russia. It is based on the proven Kamov 27-28 anti-submarine utility helicopter that China has already in service. The Camp of 31 features an E801M Russian solid state radar. When the helicopter is airborne, the antenna extends down below the helicopter's fuselage, where it rotates with one revolution every 10 seconds. While the helicopter is on the deck or at an airbase, the antenna is retracted and stored under the helicopter's belly. The exact performance is obviously secret, uh, but Open sources say that the radar can detect a fighter-sized target at up to 150 kilometers and a surface ship at up to 200 kilometers, which in both cases it is just a passable performance for an airborne early warning system if, if the numbers are indeed correct. Tracking capability should be 40 simultaneous targets. In planned service, the Camov 31 has received some updates since 2011. It features an indigenous data link system and it was modified to provide guidance for anti-ship missiles launched from surface ships, allowing over-the-horizon attacks. A pair of radar warning receivers were also installed on the sides of the nose. The future of the plans come of 31 is uncertain, with reports that China may retire the anti-submarine variants. However, come of 31s have been recently seen during trials on board the Guangxi, one of the three Type 75 landing helicopter docks. They're still completely operational. However, since the CAM of 31 was not produced in China, a national solution was required. China subsequently developed its own indigenous airborne early warning helicopter, the Z-18J, nicknamed BAT. Based on a modified Z-8 helicopter, it features a distinctive retractable radar antenna attached to the rear loading ramp. Once the helicopter is airborne, the radar is lowered vertically and rotates to provide a 360 degree coverage. The radar is thought to be a long range multimode AISA type with a detection range of over 200 kilometers. These helicopters operate from China's existing aircraft carriers. 